Uh, the Ethereal Jest Arts Council is hitting the stage with a thrilling update to a classic murder mystery. Photojournalist Bram Folk takes us inside the rehearsals for the wickedly funny play Nine Girls. I've never seen so much dust. Nobody's been here for three years. You see, it was a sorority clubhouse. It belonged to all of us. Nine Girls is a play that was written in the 40s and was so successful they turned it into a movie in the 40s about nine sorority sisters who go on a weekend getaway and they start being killed off one by one. We are taking the script and keeping it for the most part but setting it in modern times with some tweaks to give it more of a contemporary feel. Honey, you do not know your history. That cringe was old when the Spice Girls were pumping out it. <laughs> I hope that everyone has fun, because ultimately it is just kind of a fun ride to take. But the story at its core deals with issues of class, the way that we treat people who are of a lower class, even if we like to pretend that we don't, or that we've brought them into the fold to make them one of our equals. When things start going south, like who do we start blaming first, and why, and what is at the core of that reasoning? Alice. Do you mean you know something about the murder? Yes, Mary, I do. It is an all-female cast. They are some of the most talented women I've ever worked with. They have worked really hard to bring these characters alive. And then the crew, they're so great. We had people step in from other theaters in the community to help us. Everyone was really excited to get this project off the ground and super helpful. I cannot be more grateful for all of them. Nine Girls runs through March 10th at the Columbus Performing Arts Center in downtown Columbus. For a link to showtimes and ticket information, just visit this story on our website, 10tv.com.